This is me almost exactly 10 years ago. While representing Team USA, I finished fifth at the London Olympic Games in the men's 800 meters. And this is me just a few years later. You see, when I retired from pro running, I didn't have anything to train for, and I kind of let myself go. I knew that to get back in shape, I would need to set a big, crazy goal to inspire me to train harder than ever before. I wanted to set a goal that would combine two of my favorite things, running and lifting. So I thought of the craziest goal possible to deadlift 500 pounds straight into a sub five minute mile. When I set this goal in January of 2021, I could only deadlift 330 pounds, but I threw myself into training and I became a student of the sport of powerlifting. Just eight months later, I had increased my deadlift from 330 pounds to 440 pounds. And as proud as I was of moving that weight, I was still a long way away from 500 pounds. And to be honest, I thought about giving up on this goal many, many times. To help re-motivate me, I signed up for an official powerlifting competition. And many of you followed along with that programming and saw me in competition move my deadlift from 440 pounds to 452 pounds. That was still a long way from 500. Back at the gym, I decided to put my head down and go all in on the deadlift. After 12 crazy weeks, I went from 452 pounds to last weekend lifting 495 pounds successfully. Of course, I took a swing at 500 pounds and I got it off the ground. I knew that if I was going to successfully lift that weight and get around this track in under five minutes, I had to have a crowd around me. So I've got my weight, 500 pounds, an Olympic bar. Where's the crowd? Hey, there they are. What's up, Eugene? Yeah, come on. Come on, you guys. First time for everything. I'm not gonna lie, failing in front of all those people was really, really embarrassing. Once again, I was humbled by the enormity of this challenge. I left the track that day frustrated and disappointed, but these are emotions that I felt many, many times before as a professional runner. And one thing I know about these emotions, there's only one way to make them go away. Get back to work. And that's exactly what I did. I put my head down and got back in on another 12 week deadlifting cycle. But I knew I couldn't take any chances this time. So there's two other things that I decided to do to make sure that I could eventually move that weight. Number one, stuffing my face. Mass moves mass. And I knew that the heavier I was at the end of the 12 weeks, the better my chances of moving 500 pounds. And I'm pleased to say that 12 weeks later, I got up to a bulky 200 pounds. Number two, I got my testosterone checked. At 38 years old, I wanted to make sure that my testosterone levels were in the normal range. So I ordered a testosterone test from the sponsor of today's video, Let's Get Checked. Let's Get Checked is the world's leading at-home health testing provider. They offer many different health test kits that arrive in discreet packaging right in your mailbox. That's right, no need to visit a doctor to better understand what's going on with your body. I took their male testosterone test and I had results back within 24 hours. If you want quicker, easy health tests without the hassle of going to a doctor, click the link in the description below and use code SIMMONS25 for 25% off any test. Fortunately, my levels came back normal and knowing this gave me the peace of mind to continue pushing hard in the gym. 12 weeks later, I knew I was ready to take another attempt. This is how it went down.
as thrilled as I am to finally have that behind me, I still have to be able to run a sub five minute mile. And I haven't run in a long time. Let's head to the track and see where I'm at. Deep breath in and I am off and running and look at me go. Guys, this is two years of training I have been working towards this. I always knew I would never get a chance to the run the mile if I couldn't deadlift 500 pounds. And with a 500 pound deadlift behind me, now I am back on my home turf, the track. But boy, that's a big bison moving through. 19 seconds for the first 109 meters and the geese are cheering me on. Let's see where I'm at for 200 meters. This is gonna tell us a lot. About the pace. Now, I know it doesn't look like I'm sprinting, but this is redlining it for me now at 200 pounds. 200 meters comes 39 seconds. Bison, you gotta pick it up. You are already off pace. But it's just so awkward carrying this much weight around. When I used to race the mile, my personal best in the mile, three minutes and 56 seconds, I was 40 pounds lighter than I am right now. I want you to imagine putting on a 40 pound weight vest and trying to sprint a mile. That is exactly what I'm doing. Now we're gonna come up on 400 meters. I'm gonna give you the split. This is gonna give us a really good idea of what kind of mile I can run right now. 80 seconds through 400 meters, and I know that is way, way too slow. That's about five minutes and 20 seconds for the mile. But you guys, in the back of my mind, I know that if there's one thing I'm an expert at, it's training for the mile. So I went ahead and wrote 31 workouts for each day in January. These are workouts designed to take someone from zero to hero in just 31 days, and I'm calling it the One More Lap Challenge. Let me explain what it is. On January 1st, you run one lap. That's 400 meters, about a quarter of a mile. On January 2, two laps, a half mile. You continue to add a lap, continue to add a quarter mile to the workout each day for the month of January. That means that on January 31st, we are running 31 laps that's just over seven miles. I've always wanted to take part in this challenge, so I've added all 31 workouts to the Nick Simmons Fit app. The app is free to download. You'll get your first seven days free, and you can go in and check out every single workout. Do them alongside me. Mark each workout as complete inside the app, and if you do all 31 workouts, you will be entered in to win the grand prize. The grand prize, you ask? A thousand dollars. That's right, one of you who completes all 31 days worth of workouts is gonna go home a thousand dollars richer. Download the Nick Simmons Fit app. I've added a link in the description below. Now let's get back to the action as I come through 800 meters. Oh, Bison, 246, 247, you're slowing down, Bison. Let's fast forward and find out just how much work I have to do in January. Five minutes comes and goes, just under 200 meters left to go. Fast forward and boom, my final mile time is five minutes and 40 seconds. I need to shave 40 plus seconds off my mile in just 31 days. All right, fam, we got work to do. Fortunately, I love training for the mile and I want you to train with me. Download the Nick Simmons Fit app today. Link in the description below. Let's get fit together. See you Gen 1. Geese, it pays to be fit.